Yo, what's up, YouTube and 2K community? We're gonna talk about fast badges, who to talk to, what game mode. Badges complete and Mamba Mentality explained. Surprise shout out also available at the end of the video. Um, by the way, we got we just had the badges pop up. Only got a little bit to go. We've had uh, how many points I got left to go. We just talked to a person with an exclamation mark, with an orange exclamation mark on their head. That's the people you want to talk to for these warehouse challenges, which will get you your badges extremely fast. Um, this is not including shooting. This is only for finishing, playmaking, and defense. All right, finishing, playmaking, and defense only. The shooting badges you would get in my career. Um, for fast badges, and we got fast badges. How you get the fast badges is exactly like that, the warehouse, okay? Um, except for shooting. Um, who to talk to? You wanna make sure you talk to the person that has the orange exclamation mark on their head, all right? game mode to play of course is this the warehouse okay and we've, we've just we just said that so um once your badges are complete you get the mamba mentality badge okay and we will explain all that um towards the end of the video um we also got later on in the video we got another surprise coming up man so we'll make sure all of you guys stay tuned all right, so here we go. Game on, man. First, first little shot here. Here we go between the legs. Thought I was open. Okay, I hold it. You know, hey, happens. But here we go. We got Parish. Parish is, uh, I don't know, weird. I don't know. The set. This center's uh, playing pretty good for a big man. Um, I don't know why we, how, why the 2K community don't pick more big big men in 2k21 next gen i'm not understanding that but there's the there's the um double between the leg type moves that will get you open for a three okay that is that is don't matter what you play you could be playing that you could be playing warehouse you could be playing career but I'm telling you the best way to get those badges is career so yeah um funny thing is i got a phone going off in here isn't that fun where is it going off? I don't even know. Goodness gracious. But anyways, uh, I, I thought I'd add a little ringtone in there, I guess. I don't know. Um, but anyways, there's a little behind the back right there. That little behind the back right there, sometimes that will get you plenty open to shoot a wide open three for some shooting badges, okay? If you get tired of playing my career, which is easy to do, everybody gets tired playing a my career. You guys can go in here and get your badges and your, and your my points all in here. In fact, you get double my points and badge points in here. So that's the, that's the crazy part. You know, and apparently I'm a statue over here with my arms moving. I don't know what's going on there, but I guess I'm not going to be moving. But anyways, um, that's how that goes. Look how wide open I am. But of course, there's a, it's weird. I was trying to set my feet and then shoot it. So that kind of made it kind of pretty contested enough to make me miss a shot. But anyways, um, how that goes we are now going to be explaining how to do the playmaking badge okay you'll give the ball to the player and ask for the ball back and then you'll go over to the side where basically the the player you want to do that with i'm not doing it right now however guys but i am going to explain it to you um, just go to the side who you want to um to the side of where the player that you want to set a screen for you and to do a uh, little pick and pop or sorry pick and roll you know and then throw an alley-oop as you see that that person has cut and is open for the dunk okay so that's how you basically want to do that um, when it comes to finishing um, you could do the between the legs and in a combo of of other things to get open you could do that right there and then do another crossover to the left side to the from the left to the right and go to the hoop that's another way um 
you can do a step back and and have a nice little boost going to the hoop too just a heads up um many a different ways you could do a um a little standstill momentum behind the back you could do that that'll get you to the hoop um you know so you could do a, a a bunch of different things that can um get you to the hoop um you can do a do like a half half spin and then be going to the hoop that's easy too so i am losing this game however you know i guess that's how it goes but anyways i kind of broke them right there quick first step is on hall of fame and I break that. But anyways, um, we're going against uh, who young as Larry Legend? Who the other guys? Uh, Robert Parrish and uh, I think Mikhail. I think I think it was Mikhail. I'm not sure who that was. It could be. Yeah, I don't know who that is. But anyways, there's another. There's an, there's the, that double double um between the leg move that's a little too wide but there's a better way to do it you can you can go you can quickly hit r2 to the right right if you have the ball in your right hand click your r2 to the right sorry if you have your ball in the right hand click your r2 and then your right stick to the left mm -hmm. then quickly r2 to r2 and your right stick to the right diagonally downwards so that's a it's another way you gotta I mean, you just gotta figure out how to get those together and and get those moves and that's the best way to get open you can also come up like basically at the top of the um kind of you know where that circle is the top of the uh circle at the where the free throw line is and you can hit the R2 and down and have a nice step back and hit a three that way too. So, um, that, like I said, that works in career. That works in career and in the warehouses. Okay, works in both. But anyways, look at that. See, two times my point, two times badge points. And then, of course, this does not give you rep, guys. It does not give you rep. It does give you... Um, you know about, about 750 or something like that is what they said per uh per game for um vc so you know in you get 750 vc in less than 10 minutes or so you know pretty good but anyways this is the since i got that badge i got that badge completed i get to pick whatever takeover i want see your takeover ankle breaker shots your extreme clamps or you know whatever you want to pick you can pick whatever you want but me being big i don't know i don't know what i went with i just don't remember let's find out let's see i'm i'm thinking about finishing moves oh no wait easy blow buys finishing moves easy blow buys finishing moves okay looks like i went with finishing moves on that one okay let's see I don't know what else I'm gonna go with after that. We'll find out. But anyways, yeah, like you can change these out anytime you want. You know, anytime you want. You can go with whatever, you can go with go with finishing move, you can go with lockdown, you can go with anything. You can, you know, whatever. Whatever you have available for your for your stuff, you can go with. Alright? That'd be it, man. Here's my here's my uh surprise part here. Look at that, man. Special appearance, fam G. You know, as you can see, I had all my shout outs available like right there. Anyways, have a good one. That's the end of the video.